in over 75 films and TV shows, but it was her role as Jackie on the hit series Roseanne that made Lori Metcalf a household name. It sure did. Now Lori's getting ready to reunite with her sitcom family while getting rave reviews on the Broadway Life stage. Life is good. We're going to talk to Lori <laughs> about all of it, but first a look at some of our favorite roles. <laughs> Lori Metcalf is an actress with a gift for comedy and a flair for the dramatic. She won three Emmys over nine seasons, playing Smart Melt Jackie on Roseanne. Well, what was the fight about? Maybe I can take a side. She'll reunite with the rest of the beloved blue collar family when the series returns next year. I like the uh, white tuxedo. Yeah. Lori has shared the big screen with A-listers, including Julia Roberts and Richard Gere in Runaway Bride and Kevin Costner in JFK. Now, the State Department issues him a new passport within 48 hours. While fans of Toy Story films will recognize her as the voice of Andy's mom. I'm sorry, honey, but you know, toys don't last forever. On the small screen, Lori's had an ongoing role as Sheldon Cooper's kind-hearted mother in The Big Bang Theory. Actually, I had him tested as a child. <laughs> Doctor says he's fine. Now she's hitting the stage in a new play, A Doll's House Part 2, earning her fourth Tony nomination. No, I don't believe that you are angry, that you're in it, that you're inside the feeling of feeling angry. I think you're just outside of it, looking at it like, oh, there's some interesting thing. <laughs> It's wow. fun watching you watch that yes. whole, your life coming before your eyes. What were you thinking? I wasn't watching. No, you weren't? No, I wasn't. No, I, I, I can't. I, 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 it's, 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 in my head it looks a certain way, so when I see it on film oh, especially. Oh, every time I glanced up, I thought you were looking right no, at I was, I, <laughs> oh. she was looking away. Oh, I see. Away. Okay, that's interesting. Some people can't stand it. Well, one of the headlines from today, you have a lot of them, because congrats on the Tony nomination, but the Roseanne reunion, I, I know will have people it. buzzing. I know. I know the timing was just so right. It just fell together so naturally that uh, it was meant to be. And uh, I saw everybody at the upfronts, and yeah. it was like old home, old times together. You know, right. it's, it's, it's. I think it's just gonna. I, we might even be on the same set that we were on. Wow! Oh my gosh. All these years later, did it did it surprise you that everyone said let's get this, let's get the band back yes, together? Yes, I think it was just a fluke that um, John Goodman was yeah. on Sarah Gilbert's show, and the uh, question talking. came up. They started talking. Would you do a reunion? Well, yes, I would. Would you? And Sarah got on the phone and called everybody. That's crazy. And everybody said yes right away. So it's going to be a limited amount of. Uh, mm -hmm. at First, eight eight episodes, episodes, would you ever do it again as a series if it yeah I mean because well the writing was always so good yeah, and yeah, it was so timely good. and yeah. now you take you pluck that family that we know up and out and put set them in 2017 <laughs> it's gonna be so <laughs> it's gonna funny. be fun speaking of writing too you're in a doll's house mm -hmm. too it, it, there's a twist on this let us know about that well, it's Adult House Part 2, it's got a very cheeky title to it. Yeah. Yeah. Because Lucas Nath, the playwright, dared to call it Adult's House, the classic by Henrik Ibsen. Yes. 1879. Yeah, a little different. Part 2. It should have with the two, like, hanging off crooked uh, at the oh, end. Because yes, because it's, yes, it's it, very you'd funny. You think, uh, because of the title, either you have to know the original, which you don't. Oh, that's good. Because the sequel stands on its own. And it, you want, might also think that it's a uh, drama. And that it's a period piece, and so maybe it's period. dated. We use period costumes. But, you but everything the... about it is contemporary, uh -huh. even the body language. Yeah, so and it's you're very, very funny. Could tell. <laughs> and I mean, the Tony nods are crazy. All four leads got nominated. That's right. It's the most nominated play. Mm -hmm. I mean, that has to feel pretty good. It was a fun Tuesday when the, <laughs> when the nominations bet. came out. We, we all gathered to do the play and, that night. And you said it was risky to sign on to this, only yeah. because it, it wasn't the, all the, the way done. The script wasn't ready. Yeah. And so um, Scott Rudin, the producer, knew that we needed some workshops. And so we all got together, all four of the actors and the playwright and Sam Gold, the director, did two quick workshops. Uh, to get it ready, but Scott knew for some reason that it could go straight to Broadway without, he is without so a wow. trial. So smart. His instincts on it yeah. were absolutely perfect. He knew what this this play needed. And how's the schedule? How's that? <laughs> you know, it's the eight show a week. Yeah. I, I'm just kind of used to it. I'm just yeah. kind of a theater rat, yeah. you know. So I I like it on in the theater on I'm stage. It's my most happy place on earth. Yeah, yes. that's great. Wow. Well, we're happy for you. We are thrilled for you. Congrats Thank on the nomination you. and on everything. You have a great, you have, yeah, everything's it's going well for you. It's good to be Lori Metcalf right now. It sure is. Not so much us, but really no. good to be here. Excellent <laughs> to be here. <laughs> great to see you, sweetie. Thanks All the best you. at the Thank Tonys. You. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here.
to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.